is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Way off base is back from an extended break. Yeah, it was uh, was that month off? We had cumpleaños. We had vacations. Yeah, I was in Las Vegas. That that place. That place. What about it? Um, definitely what happens there stays there, and I can't wait to go back. That's all I know. I I saw tomfoolery, hijinks, shenanigans, chicanery. The a lot of girls wearing not a lot of clothes, just walking down the strip. These are called hookers. No, th- these weren't hookers. It, it, well, it was it was EDC weekend, and I don't know if you've seen what these girls wear to these music festivals. But it basically consists whole lot of nothing. Basically, it consists of a bikini in bright colors and high heels. <laughs> Which I I'm for all day. I still I still think they're hookers. Well, they may be. Well, then you have the little Mexicans handing out hooker cards. I've heard about those. Those are always fun. Oh man! Can we talk about Kate Upton for a second? Oh, I would, <laughs> can we spend the whole show on Kate Upton? It's fun. Holy I, boobs! I, I fell in love with her a while back. Um, when when she she graced the cover of Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue, right? Answers on Tosh.0 last year. And she, there's a video of her online. Um, I don't know what's Dancing. Up. She was doing the Dougie uh. or something like that. And just, now she's on the cover of GQ. And those boobs look. Oh, my God. It was just. Exquisite. Str- it was really a struggle. I mean, I was with my my new lady friend. Congratulations, by the way. Yeah, she's a good girl. But, um. I was with her at Publix, and we got to check out Lion, and there's a magazine. And it was really hard for me not to grab it. And just Wait, like, you're talking about your penis or the magazine? Both. Okay. And I just wanted to grab the magazine and be like, I'm buying this, and I'm going to go home and punch my clown. Yeah, dude, she, like, I, I actually had a similar situation today. My girlfriend was checking out in front of me, and I just happened to see the glorious boobs on the front of GQ, and I'm like... Oh, well, 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 hello. Kind and of, I, I contemplated buying it. It kind of makes you, makes you uh, forget that you have a girlfriend for a second. Oh yeah, yeah. for a Ooh, night. Like, Who's this? Publix closes the ten. I might go make a run. If she was ever in Playboy, like I said earlier, if she ever had a sex tape, she would break the internet. Oh yeah, and a lot <laughs> of men would break their penises. <laughs> There'd be a lot of chafing. <laughs> A lot of chafing. I can't come to work today. Why? Uh, my hand is stuck on my penis. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have been grafted together by the friction. <laughs> oh, Lord. It would be ter. I mean, it would be awesome, but terribly awesome. And, you know, there's nothing that ladies can do because... Yeah. Well, they yeah. can go see that Magic Mike movie. Oh, all Chan- the, Channing Tatum is a stripper, apparently. All the movie with the dudes with their shirts off. Yeah, so we'll, I, I'll let she can go have girls' night, and I'm just gonna sit in my room by myself with Kate Upton. Yeah, they're gonna fucking, they're gonna uh, pound their clams <laughs> the, after they watch that. <laughs> ba 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 ba. All right. Oh God. God. Well, now well, we're off on a filthy, now, filthy note. Now that the girls have pounded their clams, 